Hey guys, it's me, that dude with a beard, with another commentary. And yes, it is on the Fiery Henry. Good for you for reading the description. Ah, uh, let's see. Few nations done, you know, trailers done, and spring trip man's done. Oh look, get the XLR uploaded in the new video. Oh, this will be good. Hey Henry, you want to know what's been really good at this point in your video? Actually editing the audio, because I cannot understand you at this point. It does get better later on, mind you, but for right now, yeah, not that great. Oh, and anyone who wants clarification, NBXLR is just some guy who popped up doing commentaries recently, and I guess he's kind of bad. Also, he reps off bot members a lot, so this will be good. OMG, a new commentator in the commentary community. Maybe their first commentary would be awesome and super spectacular. I sense great things after for this video. Oh god, what did I just watch? OBJECTION! This seems familiar. Play the clip. Ooh, a newcomer in the commentary community. Well, here's hoping that this one might actually end up being good. I was wrong, I was wrong, man overboard, man overboard! MD, I'm calling you out in first class plagiarism, and it's worse because you're commentating on the same video. Also, I'd like to point out that you stutter something you tell him he shouldn't be doing later in the video. That's more a ripoff than plagiarism. Also, as for the second point, why in the fuck didn't you bring this up later on when she says it? Or would that have been way too much effort on your part? Now, the real audio is just Justin Bieber's bullshit song, Baby. So I changed the audio to a more better song. It's called Le Vase d'Amelay, which is French for The Waltz of Amelie. Enjoy. Are you kidding me? Wow, I'm not even gonna comment on the person he's commentating on, but did you just cut yourself off? You cut yourself off. Editing. Re-listening to your video before you post it to see if there's any hiccups. Things like that can improve the quality of your video. Hold it! I find that hilarious because earlier in the video you made a similar mistake. Please take your own advice next time. I would really like evidence to prove that she actually cut herself off, because I didn't fucking notice it. Oh, and if she didn't, good job being a nitpicky douchebags. This video is not already started yet, but I'm already mad. Your grammar is horrible! Since this is your first commentary, I'm gonna let it slide that you actually use the few seconds in cliche, but... Please don't do that ever, ever again. I'm just, just, just gonna warn you there. Hey, buddy, you missed the fact that he had horrible grammar as well in there. You should probably have pointed that out. Hey, you know what I know what happened earlier in the video? So I changed the audio to a more better song. How am I supposed to know if you actually notice this if I'm the first one who actually points this out? Really, guys, could you not pay attention? <laughs> what? No, dude, seriously, I can think of people that are more amazing than Justin Bieber. I am ignoring the fact that he's basically doing a commentary on a troll, because if you're going to do a commentary on someone doing a commentary on a troll, you need to forget that they're doing a commentary on a troll, because you people say that way too much. But I'm going to say this. Don't cut off anyone in any commentary. Just say a one-off line a bunch of times. You can do that occasionally, but don't do it for almost every point in your video. OBJECTION! I feel this is a really ill-timed point. And D, you should have made this point later in the video. Then say he was making a lot of pointless statements, and then show a few clips of previous statements to back up your point. Showing it here is like the first pointless statement he's made, so it just seems like you're nitpicking. Also, MD, if you're not going to bring up the he's a troll point, don't bother putting it in your video in the first place. There's more than one way to commentate, Henry. She can do whatever way she wants. All she has to do is just improve. And, you know what, I, I do have a problem with her video, but it's nowhere near as bad as you make it out to be. Or at least what you're trying to make it out to be. Real Mature. That's something I'm tired of hearing in any argument. When someone just says something and then your only comeback is real mature, it doesn't make you come off any more mature. It makes you actually come off pretty immature. How does that make him immature? He's saying real mature because they said something that's pretty immature. You could say something like, oh, real mature is a real generic statement, which would be fine and dandy because it is. But instead you're saying it makes you come off as immature. How? 
Did you hear him when he said, Real mature. Here, I'll play it again. Real mature. It sounded pretty condescending, and the last time I checked, it's really not a good thing to sound condescending to someone. Because, guess what? It's not very mature. I'm not trying to be hard on you because this is your first commentary, just don't do that ever again. Please. Andy, this is your 11. Please stop being repetitious. I'm usually okay with skip screens, except when they're pretty freaking long. Okay, at the time the video was made, he was 15 years old. He is now 20. His girlfriend, however, is also 20 or 19. So, Larkman Killer is not a pedophile. Anyways, that is the worst insult ever. That's not a nice thing to say. Do you even know how serious pedophilia is? Don't take it as a joke. There are billions of children who don't have a childhood thanks to sick fucks. Next time you do a commentary, make sure to stock up on more pictures of your avatar. You can't just have three or four pictures of an avatar and say that's enough pictures. And second, most insults are not very nice things to say, that's why they're called insults! HOLD IT! Seriously, you're complaining about how many avatar pictures he has? How petty can you get? And to refute your point, he had at least ten or so. He definitely didn't have three or four, my friend. I'm moving on to your second point. I love how you missed the dark humor as a thing. Literally, that destroys his point a lot better. Gotcha! Wait a minute, he was being a woman throughout this entire commentary. Okay, I'm done. Okay, first off, dark humor doesn't really work here since it's a troll comment. And besides, you could have easily have just pointed out how the original commentator's point was way too fucking long, and thus, really, that would have showed her what for. Also, the joke wasn't funny. It's never funny to make a joke about someone's identity. If she identifies herself as a female, then it's perfectly fucking fine. There's no reason to go that fucking deep into someone. So yeah, that's the end of my commentary. Final thoughts? MDXLR. Your commentary wasn't great, but, you know, I, I think you're doing okay. As for you, Henry, go fall off a bridge. A short one, I mean. I don't I don't want you to hurt yourself that bad.